Aston Maldonado who just sets the fastest lap of the race. And he passed Fernando Alonso. And he is a long way clear of the... What is going on guys? It is JJ here back with a new video and today we are going to take a look at the 2012 Spanish Grand Prix. Now obviously Barcelona is this weekend and it's going to be an absolute blast. Uh, to, we, we will probably set up the live stream here today. So the link will probably be in the description below. We will be live streaming the 2012 Spanish Grand Prix. I'm hoping we're going to live stream qualifying as well and I hope to see you guys there. Um, not a ton of turnout for the last live stream but it's not something that I'm really... Um, What's the word for this? Bothered about. I, I just love watching F1 with you guys. I absolutely thoroughly enjoy it. So we're gonna take a look at the 2012 Spanish Grand Prix. It's a video you guys that said you wanted me to see for a while as well. We took a look at last year's 2021 Spanish Grand Prix, so I can see the difference in what is like nine years um, of the race and also the you know participants in it. Let me know you guys' favorite Barcelona moments, what you guys think will happen at the course, predictions. We might put out a predictions video just because tomorrow. I've never done one for F1. But it might be worth a shot, and we might throw some money on it, who knows. So yeah, let's get into the video. As well guys, you can find the original video down in the description below. Pastor Maldonado, the first Venezuelan on pole position in Formula One. How did he, he get a pole? glorious race in prospect. How did Pastor Maldonado get pole position? I don't, I don't get it. We have five oh, we ride. On. Oh, we ride. Let's Ahead do it. The drivers, and away we go here in Barcelona. It's a decent start from Maldonado. But Alonso's gaining on him as Maldonado pushes him on almost to the grass. Raikkonen's got ahead of Grosjean. Perez settling in fifth place. And Fernando Alonso's going to take him. Yeah, Fernando Alonso's going to take him. But there's Fernando Alonso into the lead by the time they get into turn two. He's done it again. He's great at starting, you know. And he's got out into the lead. Perez. Perez going wide, Martin. Left rear puncture for Sergio Perez. He's got a long run to the pits now. Alonso with an easy lead. We see Rosberg up the inside, then a Grosjean. Michael Schumacher had a good start too. Force Indies, they're still side by side. There's Lewis Hamilton, who's now up to 13, trying to make his way past Hulkenberg and then Diresta. Yeah, Hamilton locking up there as you can see oh it's still lewis hamilton and mclaren and lewis hamilton making his way past the force india so he's starting to make his way up through the field now oh it's Schumi. michael schumacher off and into the gravel head in his hands and he might have had a coming together with bruno senna by the looks of it there here we go Ooh. let's see michael schumacher running straight into the back of bruno senna it looks as if they were nearer the corner than Michael realised. He's trying to swap sides and misjudged it. Yeah, oh. Was this like the, not the beginning of the end for Michael Schumacher, but I, I mean, he kind of knew, I feel like, at this rate. the braking zone to me. They were nearer the corner than I think he realised they were. Paul DeResta very easily past Mark Webber and up into ninth place. Webber on ties that are slightly older but should still be uh, competing out there on the track with the force india looks he's like he's problem. in major problems doesn't he because they're sweeping past uh, mark weber jean eric verne and then felipe massa lewis hamilton manages to get past nico holkenberg going into turn four okay. nico holkenberg was still around here too massa has now managed to get clear of weber now he's got lewis hamilton all over his rear wing as well holkenberg fancies a go at weber and this is a cracking battle for the minor points placings at the moment to Maldonado though running still in the top two could still win this race he's having a really good race actually we're nowhere near half distance and it looks to me as if the Williams could be on the hard tire the better tire for this afternoon a fraction faster has to Maldonado comes into pit for Williams off goes the hard on goes the hard Maldonado back out again he just kept on the hard tires <laughs> Ferrari's hand. He was 1.4 behind. This needs to be the outlap of his life, and he's got a chance then. Let's have a look. He's got no traffic. He's got Riken and a long way down the road. So he's got clear air, has Pastor Maldonado, and he needs to score every breaking point, every apex. Pick up the throttle and sweetly. He's got a chance now to jump into the lead. And talking to pick, Fernando Alonso is stuck right behind Charles Pick at the moment, so maybe playing into Pastor Maldonado's hands is the fact that Alonso has been held up for a bit by a slower-moving Marussia. 
Alonso is now pitted from first. It was nine seconds clear of Kimi Raikkonen. On goes a set of the hard compound tyres. Out goes that Ferrari. Ooh, there the was gonna you take can him. see the Williams powering down the main straight. Alonso can only do 100 kilometres an hour. Pass to Maldonado, who just set the fastest lap of the race. Now and he passed Fernando Alonso. And he is a long way clear of the... Williams, you know what? They got past him all the time. I don't, he's the man when he's on, he seems like he's on. Maldonado's seven seconds ahead of Alonso. It goes Kobayashi and Sir Jensen Barton. Oh, they touch going into turn five round the left hand. This is a competitive race. A shoulder barge there. Pastor Maldonado, who has raced here many times before, but never has he been in such a glorious position as this in Formula One, out in the lead. The lead that was 7.4 seconds, and I'm not trying to put doubt on it, it's now 6.7. Maldonado pits from the lead now. So he's into the lead after 41 laps, and now comes in for what will be his final pit stop. Hard compound tie going, going on, it's taking a long, long time. Maldonado has lost time at that pit stop. Ferrari now comes. Ferrari with 20 laps Just left, they're like, all right, we need to do it. Fernando Alonso, Kimi Raikkonen will move in. Question, this is 2012. Where the hell is Sebastian Vettel? Where is Vettel in that Red Bull? Where, where, where is he? Where is he? I'm a little concerned. I haven't, I haven't seen or heard a single thing from him in this whole little race. Just how good this pit stop is. And Raikkonen's going to hold up Maldonado on those different tyres. There's no doubt about it. There goes Raikkonen and Maldonado. There's the advantage they have. And uh, it really, it's going to be fascinating to see how long Raikkonen stays out there. Still no Renault with Lotus Mechanics in the pit lane. And around goes Raikkonen again. This is playing into Ferrari's hands. It is, uh, maybe. Kimi Raikkonen trying to assist his home. Behind Kimi Raikkonen. Did his DRS uh, flap just activate a bit there, Raikkonen? He's coming see that, side, Maldonado, He's going for it into turn one. He's got the lead back, Maldonado. Taking him two laps to do it. But he's taking it from Kimi. Absolutely crucial. Alonso's done a new fastest lap of the race, a 127.3. Look at his finish. He's got to pass Raikkonen. Pastor Maldonado was in his bag he's here. Going around, but he'll have a DRS assist. And now Kimi Raikkonen is keeping him away. Over the back of him at the end of this straight. Detection point is before the last corner, and it's about now they can open it. And uh, surely Alonso's got enough. He's halfway down the straight, and he's got enough. Just easy, wasn't it? Any thoughts that Kimi Raikkonen had of uh, holding Fernando Alonso up for as long as he can? Uh, just completely nulled by the DRS advantage. And look how he's sweeping away now. Oh, and look at this then as Kobayashi. Kobayashi squeezes down the inside, didn't even need the tap. As Rosberg had left the space on the outside, Kobayashi now... With Chelsea Football Club place. on the emblem? Is that Chelsea Football In Club on the front of his car? We had four from four. It's now going to be five out of Wow, five. Pastor Maldonado. A different winner. A new winner in Formula One. It's Pastor Maldonado ahead of Fernando Alonso. Kimi Raikkonen's challenge. He came close, but not close enough. And down to Williams with their first Grand Prix victory since Juan Pablo Montoya. 2004. Okay, very good job, Pastor. P1. Good job. Very good drive. Oh, you know what? Big up him. Big up him. Big up Pastor Maldonado. That's a G. That's a G. Hands raised to their heavens. What a moment there. So much pressure from Alonso, and it was Maldonado that kept those rear tyres intact. An important day for Frank Williams, Patrick Head. This is, this is going to make everybody in the paddock happy. Well, oh, it, as it should, because Pastor Maldonado driving that well to hold off Fernando Alonso in a Ferrari. I'm actually kind of stunned. I mean, I don't know enough about Pastor Maldonado to be talking crap like this about him, but Jesus. I mean, what a race. What a race, guys. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below on the Pastor Maldonado win at the 2012 Spanish Grand Prix. And be sure to show up for the live stream that we put out uh, on Sunday. Obviously, it's going to be a really, it's going to be a blast, guys. I'm going to have an absolute blast. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And peace.